For tens of millions of years, the mysteries of the Earth have been formed in these pearl-like archipelago. Emerging from the hot fires of the Earth's core and being washed by the shore-surging waves were carved by strong winds over tens of millions of years. Artwork of art is created here. Pangu, eyewitness to one of the most soul-stirring events in the Earth's history. Now, let us travel through time and go back to the Earth's history to experience a geological adventure in Pangu. Since the birth of the Earth, hot lava has constantly flowed through cracks in the ground. This lava flowed from the core form plateaus after cooling, like cookie boxes floating on the ocean. Hence, they are called square hills. This is the origin of the Penghu Archipelago. From the air, the Penghu Archipelago, which consists of hundreds of islets with different sizes, looks like a beautiful string of pearls sprinkled over the Taiwan Strait. The islands have an abundance of marine resources and unique geological features. Each islet is unique in its own features. Basalt is the primary material that forms the Penghu Archipelago, which has also provided evidence since the volcanic lava flows of tens of millions of years ago. About 8 to 17 million years ago, the burning hot basalt lava flows gushed from the ground cracks. The lava quickly cooled after coming into contact with seawater and air. Due to the straining effect of cooling, the cooled rock was fractured into pentagonal or hexagonal joints. The shoreline around Fengwei Cave is full of such polygonal basalt rocks with different heights. In Penghu, you will find basalt rocks with diverse features. Some are straight and rising to the sky. The others are curved like long hair. How were these strange landforms formed? This is Tongpan Islet. It is a row of basalt columns about 20 meters tall, a symbol of the strength and beauty of nature. These grand basalt columns were formed when the lava flowed onto the ground after gushing from the core. The lava flow became solid and then fractured because of the contracting effect of cooling. The result, this row of high and straight pillar-like basalt rock landforms. In addition to the vertical joints, there are other different horizontal, slanted or bent joints caused by variations of cooling temperatures, positions and geographical forms. Some are like the skirt fringe of a young girl. The other draw fine and soft lines like a waterfall. Some are radiated and skyrocketed into the sky, while the other look like a lion crouching on the seashore due to the erosion of waves. Along the seashore in Penghu, nature never ceases to astonish us with its wonders. Concentric landforms are the site where the lava flows poured out from, which marks the grandeur of a specific event among the tides. The most famous one is the Lotus Seed of the Tongpan Isle. How 
powerful is the wind. Come to Penghu in the winter and you can observe the power of nature. The erosion effect wears off the edges of pentagonal and hexagonal basalt rocks and makes them column or ball-shaped. Under the strong erosion of the wind, even rocks with hard edges will be rounded off eventually. Do you notice the multitude of different sized holes in the basalt columns? Don't mistake them as practical jokes. These beehive-like holes are made by long-term corrosion resulting from rain, wind, waves, and biological factors. Rocks with these hive-like holes are called beehive rocks or maogong rocks. The wind is not just like a carving knife but also a grand master of painting. These beautiful patterns on the basalt rocks are like the tracks of the wind. The beautiful patterns on the surface of the basalt are ferric oxide layers exposed after the surface layer is weathered away. Strong winds bring high waves. This is yet another important force of nature in Penghu. This is the whale cave on Xiaomenyu. After years of lapping and pounding from the sea, a natural arch has formed. It is a masterpiece of the craftsmanship of the waves.